far. Okay, hey guys, welcome to, if I can get the mouse right, in the right direction. Just kidding, when that, this, I don't even think there's a game, tell me if there's a game called that, because that's a very interesting game it sounds like. But we are playing Empires of the Undergo, sorry about my voice today guys, it's New Year's Eve, <coughs> let's go. And by the way, let's see if I can find it. In the comments down below, what do you think this is? It basically means spider mode, just so you know. And no, not spider man, spider mode. I don't know what it does. We may try that out in a future video. I don't know if it replaces all your normal enemies with spiders or your spider and they observe you with a spider instead of ants. Let's go. So, I don't have any. I'm actually on the new computer today, guys, so... Color... No... Name... If I can spell right... Nuclear... Ants... There we go. Now, guys, I love this game. It's, it's magnificent. It's like disco. You out, you're done yourself with this game. Oh, I see the queen has taken well to her new home. It, it's <laughs> fascinating. She has already started to spawn. Incredible, really, that we found such a healthy specimen. How long until we can expect to see interspecies polymorphism? We should be patient and allow the colony to grow first. I've placed food nearby. Then, we will introduce the Formica Fusca, and observe the reaction. Excellent. Keep me updated on their progress. Look at the queen, it has a Santa hat. Never seen that before. No. Oh, I go get that food back. Come on now, my little ants. You need space to grow. Dig, dig, dig. My goodness, dude. Hold your horses. That's what we're doing. <sighs> wow, there goes the mouse. Sorry for the mouse issues, guys. What? Yay, it'll bring it up. Okay. Spend your colony here again. Yes, yes, I know about this stuff. What? Stop filling up. Yeah, sure. Build the new worker colony. This is dying for me to do that. Here, yeah, so dig that out, guys. So this is all we need to do. The queen has begun to lay new eggs. Perfect. We will soon have a thriving colony. Alright, so I only have 10, so we're gonna need- Really, I don't have enough food? Well, how about my lazy workers go down here and pick up the food? Does that sound like a good idea? Thank you. By the way, guys, these are named, um... Formica Evapta. Why are you blowing up my Formica- Why are you blowing up my Formicarium with all these dumb notifications? I don't do that. Yeah. Okay. okay, so do we have enough food? I think we do. Oh, just very quickly, I'm gonna summon these guys to go down there. By the way, you can use the mouse. I'm just gonna make them get all the food. The honeycomb is best for leveling up, but... 
at the moment, in the really early game, you don't need to level up. Now this game, it's fun, it's fun, but it's slow pace. And, well, yeah, it's, it's fun and slow pace, and it really keeps you on your toes. Oh, that's cool, that must be an update. Normally there'd be a little thing that you have to press on and it comes and do. I've never seen that before. I wonder if there's anything new in the game. Yeah, I'm gonna check the levels a bit. Yeah, there are some new- there are a few updates with how things look, I guess. It's cool. Go look at the outside. I always like the outside. This looks so nice. They should've put snow out here. So this go, if you see this, you need to put snow out here. It looks like- it looks like we're in a desert here. Go on, upgrade. Come on. I go. Oh. I don't know what kind of shape I'm building here, but I guess it's gonna be on. Yeah, it's gonna be a snake. One more out. Ooh, ooh, I'm being messy with my hexagons. Hexagons are hard to draw with. I have a fleet of ants working away. Okay, guys, you can go back into doing nothing. Alright. Let's tackle the first mission. New home. We'll do that. We'll do subjection. A new Fumacafusca colony has set up home in a rotting log, but to establish themselves will be no simple task. Alright, we're gonna do it on medium. Challenge mode. I think I may do challenge mode in a, a in another one, maybe perhaps after. We'll see this Formica Fusca Queen has set up home beneath a rotting log. She is fat and vulnerable. Her first brood will need to move quickly if the colony is to survive. Their priority now is to find food, and there is plenty around. But there are other hungry creatures down here. The workers oh. will need to be vigilant. The ants have encountered a pocket of woodworm. These defenseless weevil larvae will make an excellent meal for the colony. They will be butchered and carried off for processing. Alright, so guys, I'm gonna actually have some questions for you in this video about some of the bugs and their names. So the first question, you now you are allowed to look this up on like Twitter, not Twitter, I don't know why anyone knows Twitter, but on Google or something, like how they, like how do you guys think personally the wood got, the wood lice got it, the woodworm got it? Kill the dumb thingies so we can hatch some guys. Go on. By the way, always keep at least some of your workers on here because they'll just go, they'll kind of stay around the queen, protect the eggs and stuff. Oh, there has been an update. There's two guys in here now. Interesting. An update. Don't escape, buddy. And of course, my food storage is up here. That's why we need more food storage. I kind of like the way the new game set up. Like, I I played the I play like kind of the alpha version. I don't know if it's called like, the beta alpha. Yes, I know. I don't care about all those tips. Just 
go away. No more tips. No more notifications. Alright, <clears throat> I think that's enough food uh, storage for now. We're going to build our first blah blah blah, our first soldier. Sorry guys, I can't speak today. Alright guys, so sorry if I if I don't know how to handle all this because I think there may have been a there's gotta be a few changes elsewhere. All the changes elsewhere. Looks mighty the same to me. The only change that I can see in this level is that this is increased to two guys. Come on, you see all this food down here? I always like to have these guys. I always, I only give my soldiers orders. I always let the workers kind of run around and do whatever. Come on, go get the food. Yay, go get it. Yay. We're gonna build up another one. All right, so I think it may be about time that we stormed this area. Get the food in there. And by the way, guys, another tip is going to come up shortly when we open up that area. If you already know what the, um, if you already know what these guys are and how they got their name, then you probably know what I'm going to ask. Well, I just told you, but whatever. What do you think is the names for these little guys? You don't know what they are yet. So, you technically don't know. Get it. Go, go, go. Thank you. One, two. Alright. I think it's time to storm the nest. Not the nest, but, you know, stuff. There's three guys. Oh, yeah, not so soon. Come on, get in there. The workers have uncovered carnivorous larvae of Ochipus Olens, the devil's coach horse. What, they are what you, born ready for combat, with powerful slicing mandibles for chopping up their prey. They are still small, however, and must undergo a final pupation before their armor is fully developed. If the ants are fast, they should be able to overwhelm these critters. Okay, so what do you if think the, the devil's... Ants disturb the adult of these larvae, the outcome for the colony may not have been so fortunate. They okay, guys. Caution. Okay, thank you for stop talking. We, what do you think the Devil's Coach Horse Beetle got its name? Wait, what do y'all, what do y'all think? <sighs> I always like taking out those guys first because they're normally the weakest. And it's just kind of habit. What are you telling me about? Okay, cool. Yes, tips disabled. I already know about tips. Digging is being there's no tips. Yeah, I think I feel like the work these guys are kind of left out because they just sit here. They don't have any Santa Claus hat. Oh, I forgot about this free food down here. Whatever. In the process, we're gonna go ahead. Come on, we need our soldiers. Don't go down there without our soldiers, guys. The soldiers are the soldiers are good, but 
And then they don't do high damage, but they have a lot of health. They're a lot better than the workers I find. By the way, guys, I may do a bonus after I complete the game. The are loose in the nest. The larvae must be protected. I may try to do a kind of serious thing where I only use workers. I can't use anything else. How do you how do you think that would be? Do you think that'd be interesting? It, it would definitely increase the difficulty. I don't know. It may even make it impossible. Because there's a lot I'm thinking about right now that when I tried it for the first time, um, I used melee guys and I got my butt whooped. So, kind of, I'm kind of thinking about that and how. Now the workers are cheaper, so they will overwhelm. Okay, so yeah, so this, this. Alright, we're gonna rush into here because we need some food. We need some food ASAP. Oh, by the way, guys, it is New Year's Eve when I'm recording this video. Predators are loose in the nest. Ooh, the larvae I don't know why I'm so tired today. <laughs> um, and I am going over to one of my friends' house, so if I don't complete this level, I'm sorry. I'll do it again, or I may just not even post the video, but. I'll probably complete it because I know how to I know how to beat this. By the way guys, if you want like tips and stuff on how to do it how to complete how to the best way to do it, just ask in the comments section. You're probably going to see those throughout the video. This okay, we're just gonna have to leave all the guys there. I hope they do good. Predators are loose in the nest. The larvae must be protected. Shoot, get up there, guys. Go, 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 charge. Go down here now. Okay, there's one down. I should be going down any minute. Come on. Go down, please. Thank you. Uh, now these guys. These wood lice will make a significant addition to the colony's larders, but they are clinging tightly to the ground. It's going to take some effort to dislodge them. So what do you think the will lice got a thing? I already asked you three questions about the bugs. Where did the wood lice, the wood bloom, and the devil's coat chores beetle get? And those that's all the questions in the video. Of course there's a devil's coat chores beetle, but I mean larvae, beetle, they're pretty much the same thing, so I'm not gonna ask you the same question twice. Okay, we're getting a lot of food, which is good, but that means those our food storages are going to be full. Then you upgrade. Upgrading, upgrading. Alright, upgrade it, upgrade, 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 upgrade. Ah, I think 850 food storage. <laughs> Alright, let's go, let's go. Move out, soldiers. I don't know why I'm telling them to move out, but whatever. Oh, guys, I have played this before, so I'm probably not going to fail on too many levels unless I just don't notice something. 
and something comes in my nest and kills the queen, which is which would be very unfortunate. Right now we are killing wood lice once again. Alright, let's get a few more soldiers in here. That's probably why we're not doing so well. We need some soldiers. There we go. You're gonna need some of that food to have. You always have to maintain a maintain a good source of food in this. Else you you can't hatch. Like if you get a big army, like you don't wanna get a huge army that you can't maintain. Like you don't wanna get fifty guys and you and you only have like this amount of food. Like don't have like uh, 50 guys and go into battle like don't rush it don't if you rush it then and you and your ants don't have time to collect food then you have no and then when it becomes then you have no food to replace those ants and then the they those enemies just pick off your colony one by one until you're wiped out because they can't, you can't produce any more ants because you're not giving your ants time to collect food. They have to fight or something. And then they finally kill your queen and then you have to start all over. And it's just not good. It's not good in the neighborhood. I really need to start using the keyboard. Predators are loose in the nest. The larvae must be protected. You need to start using the arrow keys more. To I have a big colony, but I I have enough food to maintain them. I have like 18, but by the end of this, I'll probably have around maybe 50. I don't know why I've said 50. Like, is 50 my favorite number or something? Oh, that's gone. Whatever. So this is the point where you kind of have to worry about stuff because there's big groups like look at that really just this is the smallest group of the big boobs which is kind of big for 23 ants but due to our overwhelming due to ants being very good at overwhelming things surprisingly we should be able to do it oh by the way guys hit that like button subscribe subscribe to meet these two dogs he, he's awesome. He's one of my friends. He's actually the friend I'm going over for New Year's Eve today. And it's actually his his channel's birthday. In the nest. So, now you know when Meet These Two Dogs is born. See, look, that's why you don't... That's, that's, that was just an example of why you need a big group, where you need to be able to maintain it. Because that one guy just came in, and if, like... If you're hatching some, then they'll just, then they'll like do no damage when they get there. So there you go, we were able to vanquish them easily. We didn't lose too many guys. See, look, you always give them time to haul the food back to the nest. Also need to start expanding. Oh, goodness. It's always important that you have plenty of room for your eggs. My goodness, that's hurting my eyes. Ow, my eyes. Sorry that flashing is hurting you guys. I don't know what they're doing, but it should be getting out of here any minute now. This colony must remain small for now. Food is too scarce to support greater numbers. And you're probably thinking that I just disobey, disobey my own rule, but we have enough food to be able to hatch everything. And plus, th this is a this this isn't this this group is not too big, so we should be able to wipe them out easily. If our workers ever come up here and start digging, I just heard a lot of eggs hatch. There we go, they dig in. There are intruders in the nest. Okay. This is not a small one, but 
should be able to overwhelm them. Yeah, we're gonna win. We have like 22 guys, and they have... They've lost a lot more than we The have. colony is starving. <laughs> there is not enough food to feed the new brood. Oh, don't. Don't tell me that, because what are we doing? We're bringing back a whole load of food to feed. Now, you're probably wondering what I'm doing digging up here without my soldiers, but th these guys are homeless. What's your marks are homeless? At first, when I first ever played this game, I was like... All the question marks are either good things or bad things, so I always kind of waited for my soldiers to go. But now I'm just like, there's always good things, move on. Okay, so we're gonna get food from them. I'm gonna go back to the colony to get more soldiers. The col whenever I go near the queen, it seems to lag. Don't think the game likes me being near the queen. Hey game, I have to go near the queen. Alright, how are we doing up here? We're doing good. We haven't lost any guys. Well, you're probably thinking we have, but that's just because I put in new guys and they haven't hatched yet. We're gonna get all the food we need to hatch those new guys. Now we actually have to kind of bite them to get the food off. And only one ant can bite it at a time. Now there are other creatures that are bigger, which means more ants can bite on them at a time and they have more food. Yeah, the, the wood lice all disappearing now. Alright guys, you do not want to go in here. This is death land. Those are always the final guys. Always. Don't go for like the guys that were in here and then straight for them because you will get your butt kicked. There were some nasty creatures. And luckily they're not all connected together. It's kind of a first wave then second wave thing and you see the objectives up here it says kill all nearby creatures and by the way guys my new computer is a touch screen so must be protected stop don't dig don't dig thank you blank them blank them alright who are we going after next so i guess kill them kill them thank you and now we're gonna carry the food back. It's really weird. I did not want to. I did not want to say it like I was gonna say it because that would sound really wrong. So that's why I said I was gonna carry the food back. By the way, try to guess what I was gonna say. Yeah. I love this game. It's a game that I can sit here and play for a long time. We have a lot of soldiers, which is good. Yeah, so basically this is what you do. Don't don't care about any of your workers, don't well, you care about them, but don't like build a massive group of workers to do it. Cause like you don't need a lot of workers. Seven is enough workers. Like look how good they're man maintaining it. Like, just by themselves. There are intruders it. in the nest. Oh my! This com this computer seems to the not like it. What did it say? Oh, it said the battle has begun. Okay, this should stop going. Pressing all, see the health. They're doing, they're doing good. They're doing good on working their health down.
Wow, they all went down very quickly. Well, the last three did at least. Now we're going to carry the food off. And like, I don't want to say what, what would kind of make more sense. Cause just in case anyone young is watching and they, and yeah, it sounds, it sounds a little bad for young people, to be honest. So, if you want to try to guess what I was going to say, then you're welcome to, but most likely I kind of don't want to. Because in case anyone young's watching and they scroll through the comment section and then they see the thing and then they have nightmares for weeks about it. Well, you don't really have nightmares for weeks, it's just be scary. I, I don't I don't think it would be scary, it's just kinda icky. There it goes again. Or two people are they again. Alright, so yeah, this is, these are like, this is the biggest wood lice pocket that I've found in the whole game. In fact, this is kind of the only one that you see a lot of wood lice, or, oh, I mean wood worms. I can't speak today, guys. Oh dear. So yeah, we're bringing back all that food, we're gonna put it down. We have a buttload of food, we could probably spin some of that food. Sorry if my game is a little off point today. Oh yeah, we're this having colony okay. must remain small for now. Yeah, that's that's Food is bad. Too scarce to support greater numbers. Luckily we can cancel that and get some food back. Here we go. That's what the cancel button is good for in case you run out of food. How about you guys start going up there and come down? You guys, we're not... No! That's the problem with, like, the curses, like... If you call them over somewhere, some of them will just stay in there for a little bit. And then, like, and then they'll realize that they gotta move, and then they move, but... Some take but See, look, those guys just walked in there. <sighs> There we go, finally. I wish the cursor would just disappear automatically. The ants wouldn't stay there. Maybe there's not- maybe the two guys isn't up there. Oh. I normally play on easy, so on... Um, normally, I've never done it on medium, but medium is pretty easy, so... Probably because I'll play this very much. One. Dig. 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 Thank you. <clears throat> I wonder if there's gonna be more of the boss bugs. Mm -hmm. There are intruders in the nest. See, look, those guys kind of just camped there for a little bit. Guys, this is, it's kind of, why do we, why do we lose them guys? This is kind of, I'm not saying like scary, like you don't know what's going to happen next. But like, I'm so scared there's all of a sudden going to be like a breakthrough and I'm going to have to hold on. Sometimes the best thing to do if you're running out of guys, move your cursor back so your guys kind of hold there and build up and let the guys finish it off. So, yeah. Alright, I think I'm only gonna build a few more guys for this. Alright guys. We're not going in just yet, we're gonna wait till everyone is ready. Everything is built. Gotta make sure everyone is hatched. Oh, 
This is this is this is a little bit stressful. And I, ha I have another YouTube friend, but I think his name is Me to Donut Cat. I believe. Oh, that was his old. I can't remember. Whatever. Subscribe to him and like him. Like me, these two dogs. Uh, oh, ready? Yeah, let's go. Place. Thank you. Go. Let's go. I don't know why I'm singing. Predators are loose in the nest. Oh dear. The larvae must be protected. The ants have stumbled into the path of a fully developed devil's coach horse beetle, and it's hungry for breakfast. The beetle is almost four times the size of a black ant, and protected by thick plates of external armor. Whilst it bites at the tiny defenders, it sprays foul-smelling secretions from the end of its raised <laughs> abdomen, disorientating the ants. The Devil's Coach Horse is dead. Its corpse will provide food to support dozens of new brood. Yeah, you you had to say corpse, didn't you? That's what I was gonna. That's what I was. That that pretty much was what I was gonna say. So no longer need to do that anymore in the comment section because the game just told you what I was gonna say. I'm sorry, people, if it gives you nightmares. I hope it doesn't, because this is supposed to be a kid friendly channel. Yeah. Alright, here we go. 55 ants versus that big fat army. <clears throat> Predators are loose in the nest. The larvae must be protected. Oh, and I heard one go down already. Not not a big one, but one of the small ones. Is there even a point digging that? No, probably not. No, get out of here. Thank you. Dude, this is what I mean when I say hold the lines. Hold that. Stay here, guys. Yeah, it's only them two left. Alright, so they're gonna advance, but we have an army waiting for them down here. 51 ants! The problem was, like, umpteen jillion of them are sitting right here. What are you doing? Go! Attack! Get my mouse out of the way. There we go. Okay, I think we got this. Man, these things have so much darn hell. Yes, one's dead. Nice. And we should be able to easily pick off the other one. Though. This Formica Fusca colony Yay. has now established itself as a rising power in the undergrowth. Soon their territory will need to expand above ground, where new challenges await. For the time being, however, the Queen is safe. Mm -hmm. ah. Extra royal jelly. You always have extra royal jelly. It's, it's the best thing you can possibly get. Oh, yeah, return to the former cave. Let's return to the former cave. The former cave. See, 
Queen's the colony progressing? The Queen is exhibiting interesting new behaviors. I believe oh. the colony is beginning to adapt. We need four more real jelly. Four more, you have to be absolutely kidding me. Uh oh, there are baddies. I'm gonna send these guys out. <coughs> Soldiers. These guys are harmless, so they won't do anything. Kill it. Kill it. So dumb. Finally, now will you please pick it up and take it off? Thank you. Come over here and kill this thing. Okay, for real, how much health? Ooh, that's a lot of things. Yeah. 